Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the vlog. I'm David Carroll, your Las Vegas realtor with Signature Real Estate Group. And today we're back here at Summerstone Ranch, Summerstone Ridge, here in Sky Hills. This is a Richmond American product. Let me show you around. We're located out here in the northwest of Las Vegas, right off of Schumburg Road, getting close to Sky Canyon, right off of the I-215. It is a beautiful day, nice and clear today. Eight mile an hour winds, 39 degrees. Welcome home to Las Vegas. This is our winter edition, and today we're gonna to be featuring the Sarah floor plan. This is, starts at a three bedroom, two bath with a two car garage. Pricing today is $491,950, a total of 2,150 square feet. Let's take a closer look. All right, now here is the Sarah model. Look at this outdoor courtyard. Beautiful stone on it. So impressive. You get the front outdoor courtyard included out here and the rear covered patio with options to make it bigger. But this is the Sarah floor plan. Have a look. Eight foot upgraded garage door. You got dual coach lights. You bet one of those are optional. Here on the side, they do come included with a 16 sear air conditioner. It's got all your electrical, your water shutoffs, tankless hot water heater included. On the side, this must be like a C elevation. They got the stone coming up, and I love the color choice. You will have different options on the color palette as well. Optional gates here as well. Paper stones, and have a look at your outdoor courtyard. When you're sitting on these low, low ones they got out here, no one can see you. Let's see how it looks. Yep, just right below the wall. Isn't that something? Welcome to the northwest of Las Vegas. Definitely do the eight-foot garage door upgrade. It helps. Got the two-panel traditional eight-foot door. Looks like we're going to have ten-foot ceilings. Let's head inside. And welcome to the Sarah model here at Summerstone Ridge. Some of your options for structural include 12-foot center meat slide. You can add the bedroom four with bath, covered patio number two, deluxe owner's bath, dining, garage storage, powder, Walk-in shower in the primary. Have a look around. Now the Sarah is definitely one of the favorites because as soon as you walk in, you just got this straight through open floor plan. Lots of creativity for your, to set up your dining, your living room. Now here in the great room, it's 1810 by 148 and it is a stunner. Let me show you on the floor. They've got this nine inch Luxury vinyl planks and they are gorgeous. Well, it looks like they have nine inch and like a seven inch and a five inch. Can you see that? So what a wild way to do it. This is the nine inch, then they got a seven inch and then they got a five inch. This is the style I have in my house, a five inch. And I just love the luxury vinyl planks. But what an interesting setup. Coming back to the great room, you do get this standard with double doors and then a window, but you can opt for this 12 foot center slide. I would do it. Got four can lights that are optional, a fan that's optional. High energy in this living room area. The more windows, the more light that's coming in. It just really spices up the house, absolutely. 1810 by 148. And then as you slide into the dining, it's 1810 by 126, so about 126 uh, feet here in between. 42 inch maple cabinetry. Kind of upgrade to the backsplash. No LEDs on this one. Now this top is super sweet. It does have the bullnose edge or the rolled edge on this one. So with Richmond American, I believe this comes standard. You do have to upgrade if you want the flat edges as well. Beautiful veins. This must be like a level three. Very, definitely a favorite. That white just pops. Coming over to the kitchen island. Again, more of that rounded edges on your island. Here's your standard undermount, mirror sink. Standard's not bad. Sometimes if you know, depending on the budget, some people will uh, go with this one. And now this hardware is definitely upgraded, probably about 500 or so. Wow. Now coming down on the island, looks like we have our standard GE dishwasher. You will have a, quite a few options to upgrade your 
appliances as well. Now this home definitely has cabinetry, four days, a lot of standard options on this one. You get the standard double oven included. You get the cooktop, 30 inch, with the micro and vent. And is it venting out? It sure is. Not yet, but it will be. Here on the cabinetry, you do have some standard shakers with some upgraded pools here. No soft clothes, but very nice. I, I don't know how I feel about the white anymore. I feel like it's just too much white lately. I've been really into the darker colors. You do get a nice uh, crown molding included though. Dual ovens, are you ready to cook? I could use this on Thanksgiving day. Now the refrigerator is optional. And if we slide right over, we got the pantry and do you know what I'm looking for? Where are those cookies? I do like this pantry with the high ceilings. We're looking at 10 foot ceilings. Really gives it a lot of extra storage. You can just build up in there. Nice shelving as well. Now I want to come down to the baseboards. These are an upgraded five inch baseboard and it is beautiful. You do get this, the uh, skip trawl texture included. And one other thing they've done on all these ranch homes at all these models is they've been running the floor across. I think I would go with the flow. What do you guys think? I mean, this isn't too bad because on a ranch home, it's more wider the way they separate the bedrooms. Now look at the lighting. We got two lights over the dining, six cans over the kitchen. They do have the three pendant pre-wire set up as well. And I wanted to come over here and show you this cooktop. This is their standard and it is nice. If I had to choose a range versus the cooktop, I think I would do the cooktop and get the built-in oven. And look at all the storage on this. More of a traditional pool, standard side glides, and cabinets all day long. I just love that. Now let's just take a quick peek here in the backyard. You got the dual meat center slide. Let's open it up. One thing I like about the dual meat is when you open up both sides, it kind of you can have a lot of indoor and outdoor entertainment. Now the covered patio is included here at Summerstone Ranch. Multiple LEDs. You've also got a pre-wire. If we spin it around on the side, you do have your air conditioning system here on the garage side. 16 sear to be exact. Now this backyard is larger than all the backyards, almost all of them out here in this community. It's probably about a 55 foot setback. Standard lot sizes are about 5250 square feet. Now lot premiums currently are going for about 20 to 25,000. They do have two HOAs. And one is $55 a month, the other is 67, and it comes out to 122 per month. They also got an SID, which is 294 twice a year with an $8,950 payoff. Now all the homes out here in Sky Hill, Sky Canyon, you're gonna have a sit on all the homes in these communities. But look at this backyard, what an entertainer's dream. I love it. Currently 39 degrees, 3,064 feet above sea level, eight mile an hour winds. And it says we're gonna get some rain in about 10 hours. This week has been, I tell you what, this morning on my car had frost all over the windows, ice all over the windows. It was pretty wild. Now look at the back here of this yard. Definitely a favorite. It has that traditional exterior on it. And this large piece of artificial turf. What are you going to do in your backyard when you buy your home? It's going to be all dirt here in the back. You will get the pavered stones under the cover. So save some money in the budget. Now as far as budget is concerned, again, lot premiums are about $25,000. You got the base price. You're also going to have a charge for the elevation. So depending on if you go with B, C, or D. And then you have your options. Now, if you're frugal like me, maybe you can get away with 10%. Customers usually spend about 15, 20%, just depends. Let's head back in. The Sarah is so warm in here. I do approve. Now let's go here to the rear of the house. Here's the owner's bedroom, 20, 21 by 14, two square feet. It is a large one.
got room for extra couches, extra chairs. Set up your office in here. It is huge. Three windows, 10 foot ceilings, multiple can lights. And let me just show you on the ceiling. When you see the spread on the can lights that far, you've got room for days. You also got stereo speakers because it's a model. Take a look here in the primary bath. Now this is the one option that I would do all day long. The super shower usually runs about nine to 12,000. Just depends on what kind of tiles you put in there. What kind of style it be the pony wall. This one is a beauty. Large five eighths inch glass. You got the upgraded handle. Now when you get the shower, you can get the smaller glass. It does have the pop out windows. Welcome to Las Vegas. Now one thing they did in the shower is they kind of put the subway style tiles and they got these other ones running with the flow up. Kind of gives it a good vibe. Do get the rain shower included. Beautiful tiles on the floor. Nice little hex tiles. Now one thing interesting is you got the drying bench on this side. So that's where you'll put your towels, the towel rack. I like to have the towel rack close to the shower so that way you don't have to run, get water everywhere. Now they have included, uh, excuse me, upgraded the 12 by 36 tiles here on the floor. Got your water closet on the entry. And that's an upgraded toilet. You have a couple different options on the toilet. You can do comfort height, standard, comes included. But then you got like this nice traditional style coming over to the sinks. Culture marble, one and a half inch. I believe this is the included. Upgraded to the rectangle sinks and they've done the spread on the hardware That spread without the pedestal looks so rich Now here's your closet Good size closet two LEDs you got attic access all standard shelving Upgraded carpeting as well Not a bad bath. I could use that shower every day. Maybe sometimes twice a day just depends my family thinks I'm crazy all right, so that's our primary bedroom. Now, right outside, you got your washroom. We do have uh, upgraded upper cabinets. Washer and dryer are options. And I do love this, this storage area with this. This is a two panel, more of a traditional slide, eight foot. Standard comes six, eight. Look at that. I just love having the storage in my laundry room. I need more storage. All right, so that's the owner suite in the rear. Got the pantry to the right. Now here in the front, got bedroom number two. 11 six by 10 two. Dramatic 10 foot ceilings, upgraded lights, upgraded fan. Let me just spin it around this room. You know, when you come around to the closet and you see the eight foot doors, with the 10 foot ceilings. It, they look smaller, but it is huge in here. Got these traditional style windows. These are modern though. You got low E argon gas, dual pane windows. You can put your hand on it in the summer and it won't even burn. Got a nice little access to your courtyard too. You can see multiple rocker switches. You got kickler switches for your dimmers. Again, you're gonna have so many options for low voltage. You can do whatever you want almost. Now here is your shared bath. In this bath, they've upgraded the tub and shower combo. Almost pulled the tile to the ceiling. Standard comes all fiberglass. This one's got some feels on it. Feels like almost like you're at the ocean. It's a beautiful tub, fiberglass tub, upgraded nickel hardware. I do like the way the tile runs across. Now, sometimes what people will do is they'll do the cross pattern with the staggered setup. I don't know if I like the upflow as much. Now let's go ahead and spin it around. You got your single sink, rectangle undermount, Delta hardware. This is one of their included quartz shaker cabinetry. Coming right out of the bath, we've got bedroom number three. This one's 10-1 by 11-6. Also has a little bit of an entryway. Anytime you get that entryway, it gives you a, just a, it feels bigger. That's all I gotta say. 10 foot ceilings, four can lights with the fan, single window. Beautiful. Good energy in this room as well. 
take a look out that window. It's currently almost 40 degrees here in Las Vegas today. Eight mile an hour winds. We're about 3,000 feet above sea level. And they are working out here. You can see coming up Schumburg Road up Providence, you can see trucks everywhere. They've got multiple communities they're building out here. The other one that compares close to this one is Pulte, just down the road. Should be opening soon. Now here is the study. You can turn this into optional bedroom number four. You can pull in the bathroom, make it a suite. This is a nice size room. 13, three by 12, five. Beautiful decor, I love the way they do that. Wow, that is just amazing. This room has a great vibe. It does have this little corner area here, so it makes it feel so, so open. And with all the upgraded flooring here, it is just perfect. So right next door we have our bath, upgraded on the toilet, upgraded on the hardware. This is that toilet I was talking about. Kind of has that traditional look. I kind of like more of a modern versus, this looks a little bit more old school to me, but I do like the comfort height. Right next door we have a closet. Got your smart box for your router, all your ethernet and cable. We got your alarm controls. Now one, I believe these are the standard kind of knobs and then you can kind of go to those modern packages where they uh, look a little more modern. And if we spin it around, you have access to the two car garage. Have a look. Got the upgraded eight foot door. Does come standard with a garage door opener. Tankless hot water heater. Now here on the side, you do have your rain bird for all your front outdoor irrigation. Now when you do do your rear landscaping, the, the uh, landscapers can go ahead and plug up. It's all wired up back there. You do have your fire sprinkler, per code, your water shut off, your water pressure. You can also shut off your irrigation from here as well. On this side, we have our tankless hot water heater. Byron and I, very good. Here's your soft water loop. It is an option. Usually not too bad on the option, and then you can uh, plumb up your soft water system. Good size. Very tall ceilings in here. You got the fluorescent lighting. What do you guys think? That's the Sarah model here at Summer Stone Ranch and. Northwest Las Vegas. If you'd like any more information, give me a call anytime. And if you like the video, hit like, hit subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.